I'm Julia Baker. I swapped corporate America for the kitchen and I never look back. Now I'm a chef with a chocolate company and dessert cafes and a passion for everything sweet. Stunning cakes, unique cookies, decadent chocolates and desserts, and even dazzling savory dishes. It's all about making life sweet. It starts with our hala. Nice thick pieces. Okay, second item, the egg mixture. So easy, three ingredients. Two eggs. I like to crack them on the board instead of on the bowl, just to eliminate getting any type of shell into my egg mixture. One and a third cups of milk. I like whole milk. You could even throw in a little bit of heavy cream if you like something more rich. Rich is not a bad thing. And now, the sweetness. You've gotta have sweet in your French toast. This is something I didn't know as a little kid. Three tablespoons of sugar, just right into that egg. I told you this was gonna be really simple, really quick. And a whisk. I'm gonna take the challah and soak it in the egg. You want the egg to really soak into that bread. I'm gonna get the pan on medium-high heat. You want it to be really hot. And here's the trick. It's a lot of butter, of course, and we're just gonna let this thing melt and turn a little bit of brown. And at this point, it's ready. Here we go. Oh, perfect. It's gonna be very, very fast on the skillet. It's the sugar that was in our egg mixture that's gonna caramelize with that hot brown butter. It's gonna create this crispy outside when we bite into that thick egg bread. This pan perdu, it's the perfect combination of sweet and savory. Oh, this is just gorgeous. Okay, for the chicken. This is such an easy dish. All I have to do is pull off some chicken onto the French toast, and it's brunch time. I love how this falls off the bone. Mm. It's the greatest. I'm just gonna use a little white meat because you know what is my favorite part? The thighs, that's where it's at. There we go. Now, something maybe you don't know, it's like the jewels of this little bird. Right on the back of the bird, there's a little concave hole. It's called the chicken oyster. It's so good. I'm gonna top off my French toast with one, and I'm gonna eat the other. <laughs> Juicy, it's absolutely the best part of a bird. Maple syrup, only use the real stuff. This is what your taste buds love. The salty that's on the outside of the chicken, the sweet of that maple syrup. Just a few chives, and you don't have to get fancy. No chopping needed, just a little decor and brunch is served.